What is up? I'm back again, and this time I'm going to open up a Pokemon Celebrations Pikachu VMAX Premium Figure Collection. <laughs> um, and I actually got two of them at Target, so I'm going to keep this one sealed, and I'm going to open up the other one. Okay, here we've got the one that's going to get opened up, so let's get to it. Okay, I opened it off, uh, off screen because it was a lot easier, so um, I have released Big Chungus from his prison, so he places this normal Pikachu, I guess, this, this sort of weird uh, battery charger Pikachu. He's got, a, he's got a USB slot somewhere. There we go. <laughs> right leg. For the promo cards, we have this... For some reason I want to say he's playing soccer or something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It just looks like he's gonna he's running down the field or something, he's gonna kick a ball or something, but uh apparently doing a full tackle. Which also does uh three damage to itself, so maybe you should find some uh safer moves to do. We also have uh Big Chungus himself on this uh VMAX card. Gigantamax. Which does the G Max full tackle. Now for the packs themselves, we have a Vivid Voltage and two Chilling Rain packs, as well as eight Celebrations packs. Okay, starting off with the Chilling Rain pack, we have a Galarian Slowpoke. This is a really nice card, Kimura. A Coughing, a not really nice Coughing. Uh, it's a Kasubi, my favorite artist. I have to say it's probably my favorite coughing card I've ever seen, so... <laughs> probably would have bought this one uh, as a single if I had never pulled it. We have a Galarian Yamask. Snow Runt. A Bone Sweet. Blitzel Reverse. And a Rare is a Golurk. Have a Leaf Energy, Melanie, Expedition Uniform, and a Hat Trim. Which, uh, nice card. I don't know if I've ever seen this Pokemon before. <laughs> if I did, I forgot about it. Okay, the second Chilling Rain pack. Have a Score Bunny, Shepet, a Cub Fu. Blitzel, Quillish, or Quillish, Quillafish. A uh, reverse is the Echoing Horn. And a Bomb of Snow is the rare. So not much in that pack. Got a Fighting Energy, Drizzle, a uh, Cybold, and a Melanie. Now for the Vivid Voltage pack. Let's see if we can get the Hyper Rare VMAX Pikachu. <laughs> Probably not. Okay, we've got a C dot, sand dial, nice sand dial, Joltik, Pharaoh seed, Shepet, nice Shepet, a Loudred reverse, and a, oh, ooh, nice, uh, Colossal V. Um, yeah, nice V card. Nice similar to the Rhyperior I pulled. Colossal is kind of a Pokemon I associate with sort of Rhyperior or Rhydon. Um, kind of looks like him <laughs> vaguely. <laughs> um, I also have the Water Energy, Subat, League Staff, and a uh, my Cargo. Nice that we could get a uh, good pull out of one of those three non-Celebrations uh, packs, and hopefully this can lead to some better pulls for the Celebrations packs and uh, no more Cleffas, so let's see what we can get. Here's the eight Celebrations packs I'm about to crack open. Starting off with the Groudon, Reshiram, oh wow, <laughs> uh, Charizard, wow, yes. 
Uh, this is the best card I think in the pack you can get. Maybe the Shining Mew is uh, rare or more valuable, but wow, this is awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, my first pack of Pokemon cards I've ever opened um, was a base set pack in 1998 probably. And I pulled a Charizard, which sadly was part of the cards I got stolen from uh, at chess club, <laughs> which <laughs> I didn't want to do chess club in the first place. So I um, feel justified in <laughs> my, my bias against chess club, especially after that incident. So uh, yeah, really a good pull <laughs> after, after so many Cleffas in a row. Uh, yeah, wow. Centering looks nice to <laughs> you. Uh, maybe it's a little, I don't know, a little more towards, I don't know. Actually, it looks pretty good. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to get it graded or anything, but wow. Nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> so that's just, this is definitely a Charizard, so. <laughs> what, what is this in the next card? Probably not a Charizard. A Mew, so. Hey. Um, yeah, Mew's good too, <laughs> but uh, Charizard's even better, so. Yeah. Good, one, good, good first pack magic, I guess, on this one. Um, uh, I'm going to put this in a sleeve now. My hands are getting sweaty. Okay, I've uh, I've washed my hands and I put the uh, Charizard in the top loader, so I'm ready for the next pack now. Okay, the next pack, we have a Cosmoum, Dialga, Zekrom, so no, no, no two Charizards in a row. Um, and a Zacian V, no, no. <laughs> oh, why can't I pull Zam Zamazenta? It's like my fourth or fifth Zacian now. I still need Zamazenta. Okay, next pack, we have a Zekrom, Cosmoum, Cosmog, and a Lunala. So nothing in that one. Okay, next pack, we have a Kyogre, Cosmoum, Rocket Zapdos. I have a lot of Rocket Zapdos too. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, we have another Rocket Zapdos and a Pikachu. Okay, can't be too mad about the Zapdos since I got the Charizard in this box. Okay, we have Palkia, Zekrom, Groudon, and a Flying Pikachu. Okay, next up. We have a Dialga, Palkia, Ho-Oh, and a Surfing Pikachu. Okay, second to last pack, we have a Ho-Oh, Lugia, a Claydol, which I already have. <laughs> so, yeah, the Charizard was good, but uh, Claydol and Zapdos is not as good. And a Professor's Research which is not bad. Okay, last pack. We have a Zekrom. Ho-Oh. Oh, yes! Yes! Wow. <laughs> I think I wanted this more than the uh, Charizard. Although, uh, if, I, if I pulled one, I'd probably rather pull the Charizard because this one's cheaper to buy. Um, but, uh, <laughs> wow. Now this, the Charizard and the Umbreon are three that, like, I mean, probably the most expensive, besides the Shining Mew, but the three classic cards I wanted the most. And, uh, yeah, two in this box. Well, I, I picked <laughs> I picked the right box to keep sealed, probably. Um, I can't imagine <laughs> having a, a Charizard, a Shining Magikarp, and the Umbreon. Probably not, but, uh, wow, nice. I mean, this is... I opened quite a few, uh, I think this is Neo... Oh, wow, what is this? Neo Discovery? Or no, Neo Revelations. I opened quite a few like first edition packs when that series was new, and I had like a Ho Ho, a, the le three legendary dogs. I had some pretty good pulls, but none of the shining cards, the Magic Carpet, the Gyarados. So pretty nice to get this one, uh, even if it is a reprint. Um, shining Magic Carp is one of the kind of most iconic shiny Pokemon. I mean. Shining Gyarados was kind of, um, it was the first like Pokemon that you're kind of given away in the gold and silver. Um, so having a Shining Magikarp is a, a 
really nice pull <laughs> for the last pack. So man, first pack and last pack, the Charizard and the Shining Magikarp. Wow, this is one of the best boxes I've opened, <laughs> probably. Um, let's see what the last card is. Uh, it's a Sugaleo, so no, uh, no, no Shining Mew for the last card. But uh, yeah, really nice uh, Shining Magikarp to go along with yeah, Charizard. Not Shining, though, but uh, it'd be pretty cool to have a Charizard in this pose with the Shining would be nice, maybe. I mean, they'll, probably, they'll probably do that at some point. They've had so many Charizards at this point. But yeah, let's uh, go to the conclusion. That about does it for today's video. Um, definitely a uh, big chungus over here brought me some good luck with this box opening. <laughs> Uh, got the Charizard and the Shining Magikarp. Um, you can let me know what your favorite card was. Um, I have to say mine's probably the Charizard. <laughs> Although I said I kind of wanted the Shining Magikarp almost as much, but uh, I mean, I, I still like the Charizard design better. It's pretty iconic at this point. Um, first rare I've ever pulled, so it has sentimental value with that too, so. Um, I also have uh, some comparisons. We got a, uh, this is the 20th anniversary Charizard, the Japanese version. I don't actually have the Evolutions Charizard, but the Japanese one's really nice looking. It's maybe the, the best looking one I have. Um, we've got uh, the damaged, <laughs> the damaged base set Charizard. Um, this is kind of what this is modeled after. My uh, original non-damaged, although it probably wasn't in mint condition. Like I said, we got stolen, so just got this one I got from a trade, probably. Because I don't think I would have done this to my card, so. Um, have those two. Also have these. We got the uh, base set 2 Charizard, which has the uh, kind of galaxy foil. And the, uh, the CD promo Charizard. Um, which I always wanted as a kid, or kind of vaguely knew about, but uh, didn't get it until about a couple years ago, so. But uh, yeah, there's Charizard. It's kind of the best pull in the set, so pretty glad I got it, so. Till next time, see ya. Peace.